برو یه چی It's May, it's May It's your favorite day How you doing? Um, I've got a test of patience at work today For the hundredth time on this vlog I've just got to let it go And let it pass I just think I'm heading for better things That's what I've got to think. I've just had, look, there's a person I've been working with, I've been basically saying, this person isn't, can't do the job. Constantly having to help the person, constantly having to, and it's, I don't mind helping people, I don't have a problem with helping people, but, um, I mean, it's not a thing that they need help, they just skive a lot and make excuses for the fact they can't do the job. And then I keep saying to them, well, oh, it's a relation of somebody upstairs. And I keep saying to them, well, you wouldn't be here for, them for that fucking relation. Because if anybody else come in here saying, oh, I can't do that, you'd be gone. So I've made my point very clear is that I don't want that person here. I don't want that person working here. And, um,. The decisions basically be made over my over my head that I don't know them considering taking this person on. I'm just like, okay, whatever. I've grown because a year ago I probably would have thrown this computer through the through the window, but I've grown. Just yeah, whatever. Go ahead. This is also at the threat of me saying this, that if this person stays here, the other person, because there's three of us that are down here in the warehouse, this was also a threat of, if you keep this person here, the other person might eventually leave because they have to do more work. And the response from my manager was like, you know, sometimes you've got to, you know, you've got to kick a bit of arse. You know, I do it all the time. You know, I do it all the time. You know, that's what you've got to do. And like, or oh, what about the person who just can't do the job and it doesn't matter how many times you tell them to do the job, they just don't do it. Well, you know, you just can't get the horse. So my, my attitude towards it is, well, if I keep telling them because I'm very black, you're shit. I mean, I'll, I'll probably say those words to the person. You're shit. And I keep saying that to them. And then you take them upstairs and tell them, great. And you're over me, then no wonder they don't take what I'm saying to them serious. Anyway, rant over. Um, I'm going to show you my. I got a job lot of leather jackets yesterday. I'm going to show you them in a minute. Also, I've had two parcels when I got home, so that's going to be the rest of the vlog. See you in a bit. What up, YouTube? Um, this is the package I got today. It's way too big. Um, I'm not going to show you this today, there's just too much, um, but I'll show you my leather jacket. What up YouTube, um, as you've just seen that box is way too big, it's about, I think about quarter to eleven, Shell's just booked a holiday, um, I think we both agreed after showing you previously on a vlog, um, there was a lady in Wolverhampton who got hit round the head with uh, a board from the top of one of the buildings and it was really windy and uh, the stuff that's happened in London the past couple of days we've both just kind of gone oh, fuck this shit we only live once you want to go abroad let's go abroad so we're going abroad actually give me one second You should be able to hear me clearly now. Um, yeah, so we just went, fuck it, let's go abroad. So we'll go on Menorca um, at some point. Anyway, that package, it's way too big to get into. I think I'm going to go through it the weekend. Um, but the other day, I found um, uh, a job lot on Spock of some leather jackets for 20 quid and there's eight of them 
I'm going to show you the one that made me go for it in a minute. Um, I'm gonna, yeah, the one that made me go for it, that made me want to look, look into it properly. Um, but I'm going to show you the, the cheaper ones first. And also I need some advice. Um, so if there's anybody who... I think there's people that watch my vlogs that do clothing. I need some advice on these following um, jackets because I'm not sure if I can sell these on eBay. So, right, first of all, yeah. oh, nice leather jacket. But the reason why I need to ask is that the you see RGA now I didn't realise because I asked the lady who was selling these jackets um, what label she had um, what I didn't realise is RGA is actually meant to be a Marnie or something but when I've looked more into it um, I don't think it's real a Marnie um, and I think eBay obviously I wouldn't advertise it as a money. I can't even say the word is it a money. A money sounds like the bird off um Harry Potter. Well I can't a money. It's a money isn't it? You know what I mean? Um I R M I N I a money. Anyway. Um, yeah, it says on eBay for people to watch out with um, fake Armani and RGA is meant to be fake Armani. So I've got, I've got a couple of jackets that I've got this, um, yeah that's the same RGA on there. Now what I wanted to know is can I sell these? But advertise them as not being a money. If you know what I mean. Yeah, um, as they're not being a money. Because I wouldn't advertise them as being. I'm, I'm not saying that word. R money. Is it R? It's R money. It? Whatever. You know what I mean. Can I advertise. Can I say they're not R money? Or because it's got that symbol on, well, I'll get in trouble with eBay for it. So you can hollow it, your boy, with that. Right, got another jacket here. A oh, nice big long brown. Um, I don't think this really has a name. Um, so I'm gonna, it's pretty beat up, to be fair. And um, these long brown ones, as you can tell, it's not in the best condition. But uh, these long brown ones, I've seen, I've seen long ones on eBay that don't look in the best condition. Um, and also I don't think that's real leather. Um, so I'm going to aim for a tenner. Um, then we've got a few here. Uh, yeah, that's Marks and Spencers. Marks and Spencers, though, the jacket. Um, it says 100% leather on the label, uh, so I'm, I'm going for, they've sold an eBay for about 15, so I'm going 15 for that. You've got this knife, which I didn't think was real leather, it's actually real leather when you look at the label. Um, it's a Wallace, size 14 jacket, get about 20 quid for that one. This one's pretty heavy. What's this? Um, modern classics leather. This one's really heavy. Uh, yeah, again, 15, 20 quid on that one. So, yeah, as I said, I paid 20 quid. On those alone, what's that? 15, 30, 50, 60 quid, maybe on them. This hoodie does me no favours. Right, but then, out of the eight, there was these two ones, which 
I reckon I can probably get 50 quid on each of them. Um, there was this one first, um, which is skins. I've never really dealt with leather jackets, but a skins jacket. Um, this one, one that was just like this, has sold for 53 quid. And then um, the reason why I even looked at this haul was for this jacket. Just for this jacket. Now, the inside tag is cowhide. Now, I've seen somebody aiming for 80 quid on this jacket. Um, I don't think I'm going to go that high. I think I'm going to go for 50. But when you work it out, I paid £2.50 for it. When you had a poor jacket. So, yeah. I like it too far. That's a small one. But yeah, this one. I think that's the reason why I went for it. And by the looks of it, my eyes um, didn't deceive me. Yeah, so that's what I was saying. Um, yeah, I'm going to aim for 50 quid on that. So, in all, with these, I don't know what to do with these fake Armani ones am I allowed to put them on eBay and just not advertise them as Armani I don't know if you do know let me know but um without those two fifty hundred about hundred and sixty quid I'm gonna aim for without these two fake Armani ones but anyway um I wanna go to bed I'm tired uh, I don't know whether I'm going to show you that box tomorrow. Um, I'm not sure if I'll have time to break it all down. But uh, I will show you during the weekend. I think it's it's all it's that big Nerf gun haul and um, RC cars and stuff like that that's in there. But anyway, I'm going to bed. So, peace out. Stay safe. Stay beautiful. I'll catch you all tomorrow. Mwah. Oh, 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 oh,